There's been some incredible achievements here at Dune Ray over the last 12 months uh, and achievements that the team can be incredibly proud of. We've continued to, to work a highly important project for the UK government on our exotics programme but there's been some significant hazard reduction right across the site both in DFR reactor, in PFR reactor, in the fuel cycle area, in the waste area, right across the site there's been some significant hazard reduction. A big achievement of DFR over the last 12 months has been the final uh, disposal of the bulk liquid metal coolant that we used uh, in the primary vessel. In 2012 we got rid of 55 of the 57 tonnes of primary coolant. The final two tonnes were a bit more difficult to get at so we had to spend some time designing equipment so we could access those areas. That was finally removed in August of 2016 so that removed one of the key significant hazards from the site, which is what decommissioning is really all about. Within 1217, the significant achievement has been reducing the a high active cell down to a low active cell to the point that we're now ready to cut the cell structure up into chunks and consign it direct as waste. Um, as part of this process we've had 125 roof blocks which are form the roof of these cells. Um, to date we've only got nine left to consign. This is the, a key stage um, to ready the building for demolition. Last September we completed the major milestone to process the raffinate from DFR reprocessing. Re processing raffinate is one of the high hazard waste streams that we have on the site and what we've now done is put it into passively safe waste form. In terms of waste quantities, the volume of liquid raffinate was about 230 metre cubes of waste. Once we've conditioned that by mixing it with cement powders we create 875 drums of uh, immobilised waste in a stainless steel drum. Over the last year we've been looking at some historical information so that we can do an options assessment on information on a floor slab to demonstrate whether the residual contamination in the floor slab meets requirements of interim end state. achievements for um, D1211, the uh, redundant effluent treatment plant. The, the team are at the point where they're 90% complete pit 2, which is one of two large concrete block lined uh, pits. In total there's over 85,000 brocks with high um, alpha and beta gamma contamination um, and to date the guys have nearly removed 30,000 of these blocks. So Dunray's role is to support the Caithness and North Sutherland Regeneration Partnership, which was created to offset the jobs that are going to be running down at Dunray. The opportunities in our area are immense, and we have put in ourselves, plus other partners, quite an extensive amount of funding and resource to help infrastructure, such as Wick Harbour. We have other examples, Scrapster Harbour, eh, Wick Airport, and a whole labyrinth of other investments right across Caithness and North Sutherland. The CNC's core role is in our protection for the nuclear industry, civil nuclear industry. Uh, so we clearly understand what we do with our mission statement. Uh, our mission is to deter any attack, uh, is to defend, deny access to new nuclear material, and if that material or facilities are 
compromised, then we recover the material or the facilities. By doing that, we're actually keeping the community safe. Uh, we're providing an additional service. We're working with the community, identifying issues. When we come across them, we deal with them. What's made these achievements so successful is teamwork. Without teamwork, we cannot succeed. Safety, security and environmental compliance will be the number one priority for Dunray forever. That's not going away. With more work and more hazard reduction comes an even clearer focus on ensuring that Dunray is the safest possible site it can be. And whilst we've had some excellent performance in our lagging indicators, we can't be complacent. We've got to ensure that our nuclear safety culture and security culture continue to be improved right throughout the coming years. Thank you.